My name is Gary Miller. I have a role at the University of Auckland as the director of the Graduate School of Engineering. I'm an engineer myself, I'm a civil engineer by background, and it's a real privilege to have this role as a director of the Graduate School. The Master of Professional Engineering program was created for people who aspire to become the future leaders in the civil sector. If you want to become a chartered engineer, it's really important that you have a Washington Accord accredited degree and the professional masters will provide that accreditation. This is the first one in New Zealand that we'll offer. In terms of what students should know coming into the program is elements around some core maths and physics. And so there's a prior knowledge, but I'd put on addition to that is a desire and an appetite for knowledge and a willingness uh, to learn. Uh, and that desire is more important in my view than necessarily just the, the technical prior knowledge. The prior knowledge is important because there are elements of maths that you need. But couple of that with that really strong desire and you, you're on the right track. There are a number of reasons why you'd want to do a master's degree uh, in this particular programme. I think education is always a great investment for greater knowledge, development of your skills and competences. And doing the master's will grow your confidence. I think the other main element of it is giving you career progression. So um, in the profession, it's really important to have the right credentials and a master's degree is part of career progression. Uh, and doing a master's will um, invariably help you with your next step in your career, whether, wherever that may take you. People who want to be globally mobile, to have a Washington Accord accredited, which is recognized around the world. Uh, anybody who doesn't currently have a bachelor's degree, which has that Washington Accord accreditation, uh, who wants to be a civil engineer uh, should consider this program. Civil graduates have opportunities for some really, really cool jobs. I think some of the best jobs in the world, in fact. Uh, and that's because you get to shape the future of our physical infrastructure, which in turn shapes the world. Uh, and the kind of jobs more specifically is you become designers or constructors who deliver the infrastructure. It might be that you work for consultants or contractors or for client organisations who own the assets. Uh, and you get to make important decisions. So I think civil engineer is a really exciting career, indeed uh, one of the top ones. The qualifications which are required for the Master of Professional Engineering in Civil are a relevant bachelor's degree in civil or in cognate areas. The curriculum in the programme comprises a core component of talk courses, uh, some electives in which students choose from a range of courses, all obviously relevant to civil engineering. There's a research project which enables to go into more depth in the topic of interest. And then the capstone project brings it all together uh, and that's an integrated design. So that whole curriculum uh, then provides the Washington Accord accreditation uh, against the learning outcomes. The industries that employ civil engineers are very wide. Uh, owners of infrastructure assets. So everything from water sector to roading, to airports, um, you name it, the whole infrastructure sector. Uh, also, um, employers outside civil engineering like to employ engineers because we bring problem-solving skills, good analytical skills. Uh, the other area to think about is either consultants who design, contractors who deliver, and that's a really interesting, exciting area, globally mobile, or clients who commission civil engineering uh, and make the decisions and have the budgets and hold those. There are lots of opportunities for students on the program to connect with industry. Um, there are a range of projects and lots of industry partners who want to find students to help with the projects. Uh, so that would be a really good way of gaining relevance uh, from the learning opportunity to make some connections with industry. Every student gets to do a project and the nature of the project ranges from anything which is very practical applied through to something which is more traditional research and theoretical. Uh, and every student has a choice uh, and it is a project that every student gets to do. We link with the supervisor and that's a key part of the degree. Mm -hmm.